Hello everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Supreme Alert 2020 as Vietnam. Last time we were just, eh, building up some new railways, and new summer buildings, and etc, etc. And also a bit of a time skip, as it's now January 1st, 2028. However, in between the time skip, there were two events. One is that the nation of Armenia decided to declare war for whatever reason, and pretty much result in a peace treaty being made. Relations are very bad now, same with any nations that are not allied, obviously. But back on Asia, however, as you can see, the international treaty is broken because Korea decided to break our break their alliance with us. Even though right now technically we are, at least from our side, um, ally quote-unquote but because of this I'm kind of worried that perhaps they might decide to declare war it's possible so I'll just have to send these units to Shenyang and entrench and just wait I'm gonna have some of the Navy just patrol whatever they just patrol but just gotta be ready, especially with the rather large Korean army at the moment. I mean, they do have an impressive air force, but... Not quite enough information at the moment about... Their, uh, Armies that are reserved. For the most part. Eh. On second thought, just as I say that... We're already at war. Alright. So... Uh, first I guess we could just send these units down to the town of Feng Cheng, as that's going to be the front line to hopefully reach toward uh, the capital of Seoul, which eh, doesn't look like it's going to be that easy. Also, there's a slight economic problems at the moment, but I'm going to make some changes, such as increase unemployment to 2.0, leave that alone, pension taxes above 1.5, small sales tax that. Reduce that to that, reduce this to 30, including the s uh, low income, and keep that up. Or, actually, a bit of a 10% difference, actually, or close to. And that's kind of it. Social spending, I will partially reduce it to about... Maybe that much. Just keep maintaining a 10 billion spending, at least. In the meantime... All they've sent out are just supply trucks for some reason, and I'm hearing what sounds like a naval battle. Or at least I thought I heard a naval battle going on. Oh. Okay, I don't think this frigate needs to get any closer. i not so sure. Now, of course, there's a few worries when it comes to, say, Japan. They have 73% justification. Taiwan, 73 Eastern Siberia, despite their economic situation, is also got a possibility, including most of our allies. Cambodia, however, diplomatically they're satisfied. But the people are concerned, and they do have a possibility, but unfortunately, despite all the amount of uh, espionage and sabotage, there's really not much. There's, yeah, there's really not much when it comes to trying to force uh, Cambodia to declare war on us. Well, that's not going to happen anytime soon. And firstly, I have to send the entire Air Force. So, not deselect that, pressing escape, and send them out, well, maybe not all of them, probably several that are on the Chinese mainland get to the Shenyang base. Here comes the Korean army and... It's quite an army, most are just doing nothing. But they are retreating. What's going on up here? A K2 and that's okay, that's a lot of K2s. Uh, all of you... entrench at the town of... Gongjuling. The Air Force is here, now I'm just gonna send them out to just bomb these units. Since 
King Yuan is having hard some troubles. And I guess we could destroy that uh, supply truck rather quickly. And oh, here comes the Air Force. The Korean Air Force, I mean. Okay, can we move up? Uh, not everyone, though. I want the garrisons to remain here. Don't know about Dang Dong, or however it's called. And provide support. These armors actually get over here. Everybody else is moving rather slowly. Entrench here. All these tanks are just moving across. Uh, I got several engineers. I got a few other units. Okay, the situation at Dang Dandong has not changed. And right, more K2s. Even more K2s are approaching. With some actually retreating. But first, have these guys just... Well, these guys stay here. Everybody else just slowly move forward. I still have an AT and I didn't scrap for long ago. But I want to have the artillery get over here as soon as possible. Uh, I plan to entrench. Okay, we finally took that, but the majority of the Korean army is approaching. And the bridge here, I'm hoping it won't get destroyed, but you never know. Now, what else is going on? Oh, right, the Japanese forces still have their troops here. Okay, send the armies to get up here and entrench. The other armies, I guess I could send the rest that are stationed here get up to the front lines. As soon as they can, and, uh... I don't know if I clicked on reserve, or did I click on entrench? I'm hoping it was entrench, but just in case. Entrench at... Oh, God! Okay! Uh... That's a lot of K2 tanks. Okay, I guess I have no choice but to send the entire Air Force, actually, to the front lines. Why are you all sitting out there? You, however, retreat. Same with you if you want, but I'm just gonna send you back to fight anyway. All of you, just get over here and sit over next to the small village of... Wait. Oh, Dong. Gang in this case. Which we managed to take for for uh, our air force to use as an airbase for ourselves. Well with that I gotta provide some naval support, send some submarines and have the rest of the ships just patrol and our economy is still shrinking. Okay, you know what I don't really want to do this but I got no choice but to get some bonds now. that bridge still... Where's the bridge? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. It's destroyed. Well, that sucks. So I guess we have no choice but to go around. Instead. Well, that sucks. Guess I shouldn't be surprised, but... Still. Ah, well, let's just try and establish a foothold onto these areas and... Have them on our, as our as our own. Maybe have some units head up this way towards this village. Grab a hold of these land these areas and weaken Korea a bit more. And then, if possible, if they're getting if they're driven off, perhaps rebuild that bridge if we can. We have time doubts. That's a lot of engineers. Uh, this village isn't gonna fall. Uh, most of the bombers, I guess, are ready and could begin the counteroffensive if they want to. I'm just gonna have the ground units just stay put in certain areas. Have all these units get up there. And okay, that 
still a lot of K2s. It sucks that the bridge here is gone. And these ships are barely doing any damage to this village. Get a little closer. Oh. Okay, the majority of the K2s are going around. And most are retreating due to constant fighting. And I'm running about I'm about to lose one of my destroyers due to artillery. Okay, really? The engineers can cross the river. Right. Can we take this village? At least I hope. I hope that may be possible. Uh, but it looks like the front lines are stable. Most of the time. I'm gonna have to send the Air Force once again towards this village and just bomb these engineers. So, unfortunately, the bridge here is gone. We have no choice but to go around or try and secure this area, hopefully have some of the engineers cross the river, and then probably at the same time build a new bridge, which hopefully would be built rather quickly. At least I hope so. Uh, but it looks like the Koreans are actually running out of steam. Hold on a minute. Uh, what's their supplies? Oh, in comparison to what we have, which reminds me, uh, I must unlock that. But since they're getting resupplied rather quickly... Yeah, most of the military goods are going to be down south, obviously. The rest up here is... a bit of a mix. At any rate, this, this front is actually moving rather slowly. But we are taking territory. And I don't know why this is not garrisoned. Oh well. You lot are running out of supplies rather quickly. So, that. Yeah, I do have a... Yeah, I do have a supply table here. One over here. It's just that things are just... Supplies are just being rather spread out. And it looks like most of the Korean Navy is going to be in this side. And, uh, and a single Indonesian patrol ship. Alright. Okay, we finally took that. We're going to have the Air Force get in there and just start bombing these tanks that are in the way. Or just do whatever damage they can. We have the destroyers, with the exception of this one do what they can. Uh, let's about maybe move a little closer. While I have the uh, submarines patrol. Let's see, I have frigates and all these other ships. Over here, some of the Aircraft are damaged. That's to be expected. Okay, so they not okay, so the Koreans not only have a lot of KGs which are concentrated over here. Yikes. But also a lot of engineers as well. And artillery, which is to be ex not, which is to be expected, and reinforcements have finally arrived. Oh god. Okay, I have got to send the Air Force. Forget the down bridge over here, just deal with these K2s. Hopefully, we might be able to destroy some, not all, but at least some to kind of slow down the Korean advance. Well, most are, look, look like they could be almost destroyed. Yep, that one's gone. The other fronts are a bit delayed. Surprised the Koreans aren't moving up here though, since I don't really have that much units over here. Ah well. In the meantime though... Okay, we've taken that area. 
these engineers are going to be destroyed with Koreans constantly sending reinforcements. But let's see if we can cross that. Just to see if we can do what we can. And of course have the destroyers, with some exceptions, to cross that. And perhaps start building up a new bridge. This might be bombed all the time. Okay, this front is questionable. Have the aircraft just start attacking these tanks, and what does Iran want? Okay, that's surprising, General, despite our rather um, <laughs> iffy uh, relations, but they want military goods for their wars. Should I do this? I mean, we don't really have good relations with most of our neighbors, and... Nah, forget it, Iran. I, that's, a nice off, that's a nice offer, but I'd rather help some of your enemies, so to speak. So with that, I'm going to send a lump of sum to Kuwait, and... What do they need? Consumer, military goods... Military goods is... Nah, I'm going to ignore that. Food on your hands. I'm just going to give around that much for 30 days and now they won't accept so forget anyway back to the war I got a K2 that's just sitting here in the meantime we finally actually crossed that but I want them to get over here and entrench with the exception of some of the US that can't cross and are too damaged or tanks that can't cross anyway And that airbase over there is getting a bit full. So once again, I'll send them out to just destroy some of these K2s. Which are running out of supplies and fuel, I guess. Wait, fuel? Nah, they still got plenty of reserves, I guess. But at any rate, at least we crossed, sort of. And the bridge is now being built. Kind of slowly. But I want another engineer to start crossing that bridge. Or that area at least. Move up a little bit. With a little air support at least. If if need be. And see if we can secure this town, unless the Koreans decide to counterattack. Uh, of course. Military supply base all the way in India is complete. Trade is complete. Also, the armies are just going to sit here, particularly if any of our other neighbors in this part of the empire decide to declare war. The road here is not finished since the mountains are going to be delaying any completion. I'm guessing. In the meantime, guys nice entrench there. Okay. We can barely try and take this village if we can, but I'm going to send the, my air power to just go around start bombing whatever humans that are close by. That K2 is retreating. That one's destroyed. He's damaged, but I'm gonna send these guys out to destroy it before he gets repaired. Or maybe not. Since they just ran out of supplies. Oh well. All that's left is some garrisons that are entrenched and an engineer that's sitting around. You get over here. I will get over here, but not but you lot. Head over to this village. And we've taken that town. It's good to know. Well with that, I need these guys to entrench, the rest of you go up north. Uh but not the navy, since they're gonna get over here and support this village. 
territory lost due to supplies. That's understandable. Front lines are stabilized. Now the massive t uh, K2 tank wave has been repelled. Now it's time for us to counterattack and advance slowly. But at the same time, have this bridge get built as soon as possible. Hopefully, as soon as possible, since I would rather get that build and have the reinforcements get on to the Korean Peninsula now. But we're just gonna grab land and whatever territory that they have very slowly. And we're gonna check to see what we are building. Several T90s, artillery, and all the other infantry and engineer units. Aircraft. A few bomb uh, a few bomber types, fighters and transports and such. Wait, one of them is the TU twenty twenty uh twenty two R blinder. Alright. Ships, that's gonna be rather slow. Especially all these. And missile production is gonna be as it is. Now as for ships I'm gonna take a look and see if any of my prized battleships were deployed. Nope, mostly submarines. So I'm gonna take a look at these reserve and at the same time just send their air force out once more to help the ground forces continue their advance with the exception of some units that are going to need to retreat and so forth. Alright, ships. Where are my prized battleships? I could use those to help defend this area, and that's a Taiwanese frigate. Ah, one of them is reserved, and is under attack by a Korean ship. Really? Alright, where is that battleship? Right here, and needs to be deployed. And I got no choice but to send it all the way up here. And I could use... Give it some escorts. Yeah, I'll need to give some escorts, at least. Whoops. I meant to select... This cruiser. And escort the battleship. Along with these destroyers as well. At least that's one small victory for the Korean Navy. Uh, I mean the our Navy, not the Koreans. Sheesh. Front line here is slowing down. We need to keep grab these uh, coal plants. Why are you all going out there when I order you to entrench? Seriously, entrench there, you lot just stay in the town. But I'm gonna have the Air Force get over here and start destroying some of these units. Okay, those artillery are from Japan. Don't know why they're here. Oh. Why not? Well, why would... Wait a minute, why would they need... Eh, uh, never mind. It would be interesting if Taiwan joins the war for some reason. But, sp wait, speaking of joining the war... Who would they join if that were to happen? Ah, well. Best not to think about it. For now. In the meantime... We're advancing rather quickly. We need to capture these towns and cities. Now, where's that battleship? Right here. Under, under a rather heavy escort. Too bad I can't do a formation where these ships are right in a certain uh, area around the battleship. There's nothing I can do about that. Economy and there goes another Korean ship. Need to check the economy. Well, what's our approval rating? Going down. Uh, let's see. Raise that to 45%. Social spending is currently as it is. Unfortunately, our technology level is going to be very slow, and we're producing a nuclear first nuclear weapons. Hopefully, eventually. Well, how to make at least. And 
Okay, the front line at the city of Jilin has stalled. Wu tanks need to turn around. All these units are gonna take this city of Chang Jilin. Who are how they pronounce it? Front line on the North Korean northern part of Korea. Front line is been stabilized a bit. So I guess I don't really need to send the battleship, but just in case. Just in case. All of you need to move off, except for you lot take this city. All of you take this mine, you head to this town, and that's kind of about it. I will have the transports just do whatever they want. Have we taken more cities? Yes, we have. A large city here is under siege. These garrisons have actually repelled these tanks, huh? Oh well. Hmm, more reinforcements are finally arriving, slowly. But I'm gonna send them up to this sea, at least to a, that's gonna be our current FOB. But we're gonna move up to this town. This town is gonna be ignored until we probably grab up to Dunhua and cut off most of this land, but with exception of from Eastern Siberia, since the Koreans are allies, are allies with them. Oh dear. Where is the battleship? Right here. Okay, you need to get over here and hopefully start firing. Have the Air Force out here and that verification is successful, but did that change anything? No. So that's currently a bit of a waste for these spies. So I'm just gonna have to cancel their missions. And remove that. Anyway, back up here, the battleship is now here. But I'm gonna send it a little closer if I want to. All of you, however, escort the battleship this time. The other ships can just get over here. Getting a lot, making a lot of gains in several fronts. Albeit we are a bit scattered. So how about the? I guess I'll send these guys to take uh, the town of Shulan. I finally took that city, but now it's time to head towards this town that's been an annoyance. Uh, okay, didn't need to do that. The Air Force that's stationed here needs to help. The front here is a bit of a mix. Mixed result. And right now, I need to get these units to get across the river and start entrenching on the other side, and the bridge is being built, but rather slowly. Get over here and take out these units, including this K2 if possible. Alright, we've taken that. We've taken... Well, not necessarily taking the town, but... Gotta get this engineer to get up... Or not. Well, that was a waste. Okay, well we've taken that, but I gotta have the Air Force get over here. Alright, oh, okay, let's just select all of them, you just select the battleship to get closer. Alright, that's close enough I guess, I guess you can just get Right next to the frigate that's over here. Okay, that's far enough. Just entrench here. Now 
And probably the battle should get over here instead. Alright, and what about up here? Ooh! Well, we've gained quite a lot of land, but I'm going to end right here. Well, Korea has betrayed us. They've declared war. But well, we've managed to hold off their attempted invasions from their rather massive number of K2s, but we've held out and we're going to now slowly pushing forward. Even though the bridge here is destroyed and slowly being rebuilt, we've got a small foothold here and war reinforcements are crossing the river with the exception of the tanks. But we're gaining ground. Sooner or later we might get the rest of what was Manchuria and then slowly perhaps re uh, head down from the north and start conquering the northern parts of what was North Korea. How long will this war last? Who knows. Hopefully we might reach Seoul and bring it into the war. Or will that continue on? I don't know. But I hope you enjoyed this and see you again in the next episode.